Hi, everybody, and welcome. Are you having problems clearing clutter from your space? Perhaps you want to get rid of something that you've inherited. Perhaps it's something that you just don't use anymore. Perhaps it's something you haven't touched for years, and it's just taking up space. And you know, when we have clutter in our house and in our office, we also have clutter in our minds. And did you know that when we have clutter in our spaces, it also holds energies that we don't want around. So today I'm gonna to teach you emotional freedom techniques for clearing your clutter and letting go of the emotions. First, let's run the show reel. So here's the deal. A lot of people have problems getting rid of things because they think that they have a certain monetary value, or perhaps I can sell it for money, or what if I need it next week? I don't want to get rid of it right before I might need it. Sometimes this is really unconscious where we were taught when we were young that there are poor people out there or that we need to hang on to everything because stuff means something. Maybe we didn't have much. And so there's a sense of pride in ownership. Or perhaps there's a fear that if we need it later and we get rid of it now, we won't be able to let it go. And the hardest for some people are those memories. You inherited something or there's a memory of something contained in the picture. So what I want you to do is I want you to either visualize or take that item right now. And I want you to look at it, put it in front of you if you can, or visualize it. And we're gonna do some tapping together. And you can say the same words, whether you're planning on throwing it away or donating it. So even though there's this thing in front of me, I know I should get rid of it, but I feel nervous to do so. I'm open to letting it go. And even though there's this item that I'm not ready to let go of, I mean, I want to have a clearer space. I want to have more freedom in my mind. I don't know if I want to throw it away yet. I don't know if I'm ready to donate it. And I accept all the ways I feel about it. And even though I know I want to get rid of this item, but it reminds me of some memories. I trust I can let go of this item and retain all the love and all the positive memories. Great, we're gonna tap on the top of the head. Oh, I'm open to letting this item go. It's outlived its usefulness in my world. I'm ready to let this item go. I feel resistance to letting it go. Yep, I'm feeling this resistance to letting this item go. And I'm feeling this resistance to giving it away. I'm definitely feeling resistance to throwing it away. But I'm open to letting it go anyway. Good. Now take a breath and look at it again. And notice, what do you feel? Are you feeling sadness, anxiousness, just general feelings of loss or regret? Maybe you're feeling excited to throw it away and then in fact, just go throw it away, right? And notice what you're feeling right now, rate it on a level from zero to 10. And we're gonna do this again. And you can throw your feelings in if you wish. So even though I'm feeling this resistance, 
I feel sad thinking about throwing this item away. I'm ready to let it go. And even though I'm feeling sad, even imagining getting rid of this, what if I need it? What if someone asks me where it is? Even though I'm feeling sadness, thinking about getting rid of it, I accept I feel this way. And even though I feel sadness, thinking about getting rid of this thing, maybe someone else gets to use it. Maybe someone will be really excited to have it. And even if not, I'm ready to have a clearer space. I'm ready to let it go. And I accept the way that I feel about it. Great, top of the head. I'm feeling sadness thinking about letting this go. 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 I'm feeling some sadness. But I know it's better for me if I let it go. In fact, I'm making the choice to have a cleaner space and a more healthy lifestyle for myself. I'm making the choice for me to let this go now. Good. So now notice how it's becoming easier, how you can hang on to the emotions. You do not have to hang on to the stuff to hold on to the emotions. Remember that the emotion that you feel when you look at your item, that is part of you. That is inside of you, not the items. So take the emotion out of the items, hold on to them and notice that you get to hold on to the emotions, let that item go and feel the love anyway. So remember, you can play this as often as you want for all the stuff you wanna get rid of. It's gonna be super fantastic, I promise. And you are loved, you are loving and you are lovable. Have fun. <laughs>